Even after we lost the big names like Blockbuster and Hollywood Video, some of our communities still had those nostalgic movie rental stores. But the pandemic forced many more of those small shops to close. So are any video stores left in Middle Tennessee? News Channel 5's Forrest Sanders hit the road to find out. Does a site like this just take you back? Even the carpet in here might remind you of those Friday nights when you'd grab some popcorn. Grab some of those, some of those, oh yeah, some of those. Pour a soda and pop in a movie you rented. Captain Video and Tanning once had 12 locations, but everything's just been auctioned from their Portland and White House stores. Captain Video is now gone. Just like the family video stores closed last year, and many other major movie rental stores disappeared about a decade ago. And this is something that changed fast. In the year 2000, there were more than 28,000 movie rental places across the country. Today, it's hard to find any. So does this mean there are no more movie rental stores in Middle Tennessee? No. Nope. It doesn't mean that. David Williams. I still love the magic of movies. And wife Susan Rogers. About 12,000 titles of movies. Run Northside Video in McMinnville. It's been here 38 years, complete with, yes, an overnight movie drop. While Redbox and then streaming led to the end of the major chains, the customers here just love the conversation about movies. There's the town that dreaded Sundown. Gone. Oh, yeah. It was off the market forever. You won't go back and watch an old movie, and they've got it. You might find some movies you wouldn't think to watch to become your faves. This is the only video store we have. We become a family here. They're the ones that keep us going. We need to watch the movie on Tammy Faye. But even Don't with that loyalty, stuff. the pandemic hasn't been easy for the few remaining That's video stores. Hollywood had to shut down almost completely, and we've seen very few movies coming through. Jimmy Allen, the owner over at Captain Video, told us his rent got high, and with people not getting out in the pandemic as much, he had to end his business of 40 years. But David and Susan are hanging on in McMinnville, and they're not alone. Other movie rental stores still in Middle Tennessee include Video Villa in Mount Pleasant, <laughs> being one of the last. Razorback, is that an Australian one? Yeah, it's Australian. Yeah. David and Susan know there's something special about that. Talk about this when I drive watch it. Okay. These are our friends. They're more than customers. We've seen their kids grow up. We're probably in our third generation of families. We don't have children, but they're like our kids. And David and Susan would like to invite you to make it a Northside video night. Bring the kids, let them pick out something, you pick out something, y'all go home and have a bunch of popcorn and have a good soda and have a family night together. I'm Forrest Sanders, News Channel 5.